Hey everyone, it's Natasha of Natasha's Kitchen, and today I'm gonna teach you how to make your own cake flour. Now you might be wondering, why would I wanna make that? Well, there are a few reasons. Either you found a recipe that needs it and you just don't have it in your pantry and you really wanna make those cupcakes, or maybe you wanna use better quality ingredients like organic all-purpose flour. And then finally, it's just a whole lot cheaper to make it at home. Now you guys, this recipe calls for just two ingredients. For every one cup of all-purpose flour, you'll need two tablespoons of cornstarch. So start out by measuring your flour. And it's important to scoop the flour into the measuring cup because that's the most accurate way to measure. If you just push your measuring cup into the flour, you'll compress the flour and you'll get a lot more flour that way in your cup. And you can test that by weighing it at home. So then just scoop off the top and you get a perfect one cup. Next, you're gonna set up two medium bowls and you'll need a fine mesh strainer or a flour sifter. You're gonna take your one cup of measured flour and add it to the sifter. And then we're gonna take out two tablespoons of flour. So measuring them, measure them with a measuring spoon, scrape off the top, put them right back into your flour pot. Okay. And then we're going to add two tablespoons of cornstarch. So the same process here. Scoop it in, scrape off the top, and add it right in. One and two. Okay, then we're gonna sift that together. All together, we're gonna sift it about four or five times. And that's to get the cornstarch really well incorporated into the flour. Get that whole mixture nice and airy. And it's going to be perfect. So the reason why we add cornstarch and pull out some of the flour for cake flour, when we remove some of the flour, we also remove some of the gluten. And cornstarch is a tenderizing agent, so it'll give you that nice, soft, fine crumb that you want in, in certain recipes. So that's really all there is to it. Now if a recipe calls for more cake flour, just increase everything proportionally. So for two cups of all-purpose flour, you'll need four tablespoons of cornstarch. It's so easy. Now I hope you enjoyed spending time with me in my kitchen. Make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel to be the first to see more great videos. Thanks for watching.